Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, my name's Megan and I vlog about various things in my life. Today is Valentine's Day and I am a single Pringle. So I decided to Google things of things to do on Valentine's Day when you're single. First of all, it suggested going for a walk. As you can see, the weather hasn't been great around us recently. <coughs> I do do exercise in bad weather, but it's just so cold at the moment. Another option it suggested was to go to the cinema, which obviously we are not allowed to do at the moment. And it also suggested doing some work. I don't find this a way to treat myself and I feel like I want some time off from work. So I'm going to take myself on a date instead. As I had been doing exercise this day, first of all, I went for a shower so I smelled better. Using the Solo Act Named Nail Varnish, I painted my gel nails, putting all the coats on and setting it under the LED lights. I then put on my makeup, so first of all I brushed out my eyebrows and then coloured them in with a light brown pencil because being blonde my eyebrows disappear a lot and then set them in place with some eyebrow mascara. I then attempt to contour my face with some, I think it's bronzer, and then I put some highlighter in, some blusher, I think that's blusher going in now. As you can tell, I don't normally wear makeup. I then put on my jewellery, so I have my cross around my neck, I have my pearl earrings in, they're just cheapo from Amazon, I've got my ring on. This is the final look for the face, and here are the nails. And then finally, pazow, change of clothes. Now that I've got ready for my date, I will share with you what I have. This vegan version of camembert, which is called chamembert. I do like a pun. It's said to put it in a camembert something, but I, I mean, I don't have that. So I've baked it in a love heart case. That's what it looks like. And I've also got a couple of homemade buns that I made yesterday to dip in it. Let's see what it tastes like. I enjoy it a lot. It's probably melted and it's like really dippy, which can be a struggle for vegan food. I got this Shaman Bear from a place in Cottingham called Blondes, which is my favorite vegan cafe. They know me very well in there. A lot of my long runs for marathon training just happened to finish in there. I don't think there's anything wrong with being single. Obviously as a single person, I would say this, but I have no intention of entering a relationship. Even with the pandemic, obviously I've been on my own a lot more. And during the first uh, lockdown, it was a lot harder. But now I can bubble with my parents. I do. I enjoy doing the things that I want to do, like in a selfish way. I don't really have to, not that I don't think of other people, but I don't have to take a significant other into consideration. So if I want to watch Disney Plus all night on the telly, I can watch Disney Plus all night on the telly. I also get to choose what to eat every night as well. I think Emma Watson spoke about dating herself. And I think she's onto something there. Before the pandemic, I liked to take myself on dates, like to coffee shops, cake shops, um, going to the cinema. No one eats your popcorn if you go on your own. And I just really liked it. I have a lot of friends. It's not that I don't like people. It's just that I also very much appreciate my own space and doing my own thing and enjoying a shower and bear cheese all to yourself. Thank you very much for joining me on my quest to get ready for a date with myself for Valentine's Day. I hope you're all celebrating well. Now I have noticed that Revival Coffee and Donuts are bringing out a special on Valentine's, so I do like their donuts. If you don't have a significant other, just treat yourself. If you can't love yourself, then how can you love anyone else? <laughs>